today I'm going to show you a dissolving experiment. But first, we are going to know which is the solvent, which is the solute, and which is the so solution. So, the solution is the solute and the solvent. While the sol solute is the less substance in solution and the solvent is the more substance in solution. Now, let's start the experiment. Now we are going to know the materials before doing the experiment. So the material is water, which is the solvent, four glasses for each solute, and flour, sugar, coffee powder or coffee beans, red chili flakes. Now let's learn the instructions. First, we are going to add water into the glass. Add this much of water in each glass. And then we are going to see which one is insoluble and which one is soluble. Now we are going to we are going to need two spoons, one for the picking and one for the stirring. Now let's try the floor first. Now we see the hand is stirred and added the floor. Now let's see if it's dissolved or not. Also, I have to tell you that water can dissolve anything, you know. Now I have added the floor into this glass of water and put in it for a few minutes. Now the result is that this floor is insoluble. Well, you can see that the whole water is white, but the real thing is that the floor is sitting down and it means that it's not clear. Also, it also means that uh, it, it means that uh, the floor is insoluble. Now, let's move on to the sugar. properly so we can see if it has dissolved or no. When you are done stirring properly, leave it for a few minutes so we can find out if it has dissolved or not. I have stirred the sugar into this glass of water. Hmm, I can't see any sugar on the bottom anymore, which means this thing dissolves and it is also soluble. Now let's move on to the, uh, to the coffee, uh, coffee powder. coffee powder into this glass of water. Now let's stir it properly so we can see if it has dissolved or not. Now I have added the coffee powder into this glass of water. Mm. I see no particles sitting at the bottom which means this thing had properly uh, properly dissolved and this is also soluble like the sugar let's move on to the red chili flakes I'm going to stir it properly. Now I have added the red chili flakes and stirred it properly. Um, I do see particles at the bottom which means this thing has, has not dissolved. And also it is insoluble like the flour. So my conclusion is that both of these things had not dissolved or and they are insoluble while my other conclusion about the coffee powder and the sugar is that they have both dissolved and both are soluble. Now I will make a table to see which things had dissolved here and which has not. You can make a table on a paper or a whiteboard if you want.
now are things that have not dissolved so the things that have dissolved were is one the sugar and the next was coffee powder well while the other things that were not dissolving were the flour and the red chili flakes so you can use any of these materials at home to see if some of these things have dissolved or not or you can also make a table to see which has dissolved and not hope you like this video and please subscribe like share and comment so i can make for more for you guys thank you bye